Hey guys, how y'all doing? So today is April 29th and it's my three year YouTube anniversary. Woo woo! Okay, that was a sorry woo woo. And yeah, this happened. <laughs> I'm not going to talk about it too much, but um, I know people are curious if you follow me on Instagram, and I think I had another video. I cut my fingers with the electric head skippers. Yeah, ouch. Serious ouch, and I had to go to the emergency room. That was on Thursday. I'm fine. Um, well, they hurt if you touch them. Um, and I had to get, I thought there was four stitches, but it was just three stitches each. And yeah, I will tell that whole story if you want. I'll let you know, or you let me know rather, um, whether you want to hear that whole story. And um, the girls were with me, Michaela and Abby, the littles, when that happened. So maybe I'll, I'll let you tell their end of the story too. Okay, so uh, again, it is my three year anniversary. Uh, three year ago, years ago today, I put out my first video and I'll put the link down below or put it up there in the cards. Um, my very first video, I did um, a closet organization. And I have since done that again and again and again. And guess what? It needs to do it again. I'm going to either do that this week or next week. It's it's a mess. There's clothes on the floor. And there's a huge b container, basket, laundry basket of empties. Because I just haven't had a chance to do it because I've been busy and then of course I've injured myself twice recently <laughs> if you didn't hear the story about the Panera where I got had to go to the urgent care what was it like three weeks ago I got hot soup on me anyway and I got second degree burns yada 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 oh. <laughs> anyway so also it is I hit 6,000 subscribers yay so on Instagram I um I put out a call for questions, um, but I only got like three questions, so I'm asking for questions now. Put them down in the comments below, and so I'm not going to do a Q&A today. I will do it hopefully sometime this week, and I'm thinking about doing a giveaway. Y'all know I'm not good at giveaways. I'm terrible about sending them out. I like to do them, but... I'm just terrible about sending them out. So, um, I'm thinking about doing a giveaway. So, definitely ask me your questions below. And so, instead, I'm going to do a Target haul. I've been doing a lot of self-care. And obviously, this was not self-care. <laughs> anyway, I need to slow down and breathe. And what I've been saying lately, just be. So, um, I went to Target and did some... Um, retail therapy and I do shop but don't obviously I shop but I hardly ever do any hauls so um yeah so I'm going to show you one today so I again I'm doing a self-care um video I'm hopefully we'll have that out next Sunday on Tuesday I'm getting my hair done it's way past needing done you can see the dye, my hair is like growing all the way to here. Yeah, I am going to get it highlighted and everything. And I'm thinking about getting a different cut shorter or something. I don't know. Okay, guys. So, um, I'm not going to really make any changes or anything. I know a lot of YouTubers will talk about these are the changes I'm going to make to my channel once I hit so many subscribers. Yada, yada, yada. I'm just going to be doing the same thing that I'm on always do but I am going to make one change so make sure you get watched to the end of this video so you can see that change so let's see <laughs> so what I wanted to do what I've been wanting to do but I didn't want to copy this other youtuber if you guys watch um Cassandra from Clutterbug she kind of does a little um monologue at the end of her videos and I thought maybe I would try doing that, but first of all, I'm not that funny. <laughs> and then I'm like, I don't know if I can think of that many different things that uh, she has all these crazy things happening, but I got crazy things happening to me too. But I decided I'm not going to do that. Maybe I might throw that in here and there. But at the end of every video or 
at most of my videos, I'm going to do a shout out. I'm going to do a shout out to a YouTuber that I, a new YouTuber that I'm watching or somebody that I'm really liking. I tend to not watch the same YouTubers all the time. I will like watch a couple, like a handful of YouTubers, like say five or so. I don't, know, I don't really keep track. Like five YouTubers for like a month. And then next month I'll watch five different YouTubers. And then the next month I'll go back to the other five YouTubers. I kind of jump around. I don't usually watch the same people. Well, there's a few people that I do consistently watch. But um, I'll talk about that in my shout outs. So make sure you watch the all the way to the end of this video because I'm going to do a little shout out at the end of this video and um yeah right. let me show you what I got at Target so I went to Target and Ross so let's see I, I guess so I got this <laughs> cat bed it's actually probably a dog bed so um I've actually bought three of these recently I want to say I don't have my receipts with me, guys, so I'm um, not prepared. I'm doing this on the fly. Hubby and I just got back from Michael's, and I got chicken in the oven for dinner, and we're, we're having a late dinner tonight. So we were going to go to a movie to see, um, what is it called? Infinity Wars? Um, I just didn't feel like watching the movie tonight. So um, let me know if you like that movie in the comments below, and um, yeah, I probably would go anyway because Hubby really wants to see it. Anyhow, I got this um, cat bed because um, the cats are, our cats are like 13, 14, 14, 15. I don't know. I've lost track to tell you the truth. They're around 14, 15 years old. They're a year apart. I have two cats, um, a tabby, Callie, and a um, tuxedo cat, Kirby, and Callie is Kirby's mom. And anyway, they didn't used to like to lay on these things, but I have got to get control over all of the cat hair. It is getting ridiculous. So I got I bought this one for the bed, and I have one for the couch, and then one is in the guest room on the guest bed. And she has been Callie has been laying on those. Kirby, not so much. So I want I the other thing I got um that was from Ross. I want to I said. That was $8.99. So this actually has a price tag on it. This is this from Ross too? Oh yeah, $7.99. So this was $7.99. This is a basket. And I wanted to, I recently, you might have saw that video. I recently got a new tablecloth for the patio. And I put um a vase in it there on the table as a centerpiece. But I don't really like how it looks. So I wanted to put the vase on here with some other items. So that's what I'm going to do with that. And you might see that in a future video. And I was at... So that was... I don't remember what day was that. I think that was Wednesday. And yesterday I went to go get pedicures with my sister and my grand, and my nieces. And we stopped at Target and I got two bags. They were in the dollar spot because I have a baby shower coming up on Saturday. And I was just looking around, getting some stuff, and um, looking, of course, at the Joanna Gaines Hearth and Home. No, what's it called? Yes, Hearth and Home thing. And I never have bought anything there because, frankly, I think it's too for expensive for what it is. But I saw, I saw this. <laughs> it is a tray. It is like a breakfast tray. I'm not going to use it for a breakfast tray see it here and it's wood and um, I'm going to use it for the couch um, when I'm sitting on the couch I really it's a um, sectional I really don't have a place to because I like to sit in the middle so I don't really have a place to set my drink on so I was hoping to put this on the actual couch and then putting my drink on here and sometimes I eat in there we eat dinner in there sometimes I could put my bowl on there or my plate on there and stuff like that. So I thought that was really cute. It was a little expensive. It was $24.99, but I really, really liked it. And so, and I like the little leather straps that are on that and stuff. So it was a little more than I wanted to spend, but hey, because I can. <laughs> and I believe I got these at Ross too. Oh, yes, these are towels, kitchen towels. They're $4.99. They are called Bar Mop Kitchen Towels. I'm hoping this is what I want. So, 
So I use, you know, just usually you use um, square dishcloth to wipe the counters with. And <laughs> when I was at Panera <laughs> and got hot soup burn on me, they gave me a towel to put ice in. And um, afterwards, I realized it was like a large towel. It wasn't a hand towel size, but it was between a hand towel and a dishcloth size. And I'm like, this works really well for wiping the counters. The dishcloth wasn't big enough, so I'm thinking this is the size that I want. I'm pretty sure it is because beside this, they had hand towels, and they were a little bit bigger. So I, I, so I bought some of these. There's one, two, three, four, five for $4.99 so hopefully that works out and I put some new curtains in the um, family room if you didn't see that video that was a fix it Friday with Gary video and I needed I did forgot to buy tie backs for the curtains so the and I bought these tie backs for where did I buy the tie backs? oh in the in the bedroom I also bought tie backs but they were the did I buy this color the other color or the, I think I bought this same color for the bedroom. These were only $10, guys. Target has some fairly reasonable price um, curtain rods and stuff like that. I used to always buy it at Walmart, but I actually bought the curtain rods for the curtains in the family room from um, Target, too. I don't remember the price I got, but I thought $10 was reasonable for those. They are um, oil rub bronze finish. I don't know if you can like really see that too good because it's to a new set of earrings. Um, I actually have a pair just like that, but I noticed they were getting um, tarnished, I guess. And these are sterling civil. <sighs> Can't speak. Sterling silver and nickel free. And these I got. I had to get a treat for hubby because. If it weren't for him, all of this would not be possible. <laughs> so I got some of these. I never saw those before. Do you see it? It's the orange chocolate ones. I've bought these before. I really like them. They're the wafer rolls. Um, what is the, usually like, this is the off brand. I don't remember what the name of them are. I can't think about the top of my head, but they're usually just plain chocolate. My hubby loves orange and chocolate, so mixed together. So um, I thought I would buy him this as a treat. So I bought some of those. They were $3.99. Um, Target, and I need to stop buy, buying candles. I keep saying that, and then I just keep buying them. I bought this candle. It is a soy candle. Soy candles are supposed to burn cleaner. I'm trying to only use um, wax melts. Yeah, because... They just burn nicer. They don't burn, I don't know, they're clean, a cleaner burn too. But this is a soy candle and it's called Champagne Kiss. And it is the signature soy candle. They have a whole bunch of these at Target and I like them. And the smell is so wonderful. You can actually smell like the fizziness, <laughs> I swear, when you smell it. It smells so good. So I bought it for in here in this... Um, in my craft room office area. Um, and I bought a little present for my niece. I like the little Cat and Jack um, line at Target. They're so cute. I actually bought the same outfit for Abby because it was her birthday the other day. So I decided she liked it. I wasn't sure she liked it. So I went ahead and got Kayla one too for her birthday, which is coming up in June. It's a cute, this is a cute little top and um, it was, they were on sale for $6. And then I think Abby got the pink, a pink top. Kayla got the purple one. And they both got the same skirt. And actually it's called a scooter. Um, and it has the little shorts underneath. Built in shorts underneath, which is awesome, right? So I thought that was cute. It's like ruffled. And Abby really liked hers. And Kayla said she liked it too. So I went in and got one for her. For her birthday. These and things. I've been going around the house putting some of these felt bottoms on all the furniture. Because I did it when I redid the craft room. And you guys. I have still not finished the finishing touches on that. The tour for that will be coming up. Anyway. So I put it on the bottom of all of the furniture in the craft room. Because I have the um, laminate wood flooring in here. And I didn't want it to get scratched up. 
So, and plus it's easier to slide the furniture around with on them. Like, oh, I should have done that a long time ago on the whole rest of the house. And I'm sounding a little hoarse because I didn't drink enough water today. So, I bought some more to finish up the rest of the house. Um, underneath all the furniture and stuff like the bar stews need it my kitchen chair the breakfast nook chairs need it and yeah the other thing I got from the hearth and home um, collection which I've been looking at this for months and I keep picking up and going no I don't need that but I really like it and I do really like it so I'm going to put this uh, in my breakfast um, station area in my kitchen and this was only $5.99 so this is and it has a little wood top and I really like that um so obviously put my sugar in so the other thing I got was this and this is my third bottle of it it is the soap and glory original pink body spray I love 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 this stuff it smells so good and I ran out and I'm gonna spray some of this stuff on me now and I have to tell you, I, um, that one smells a little bit different than the last one. I wonder if it's different. Hold on a second. I'm going to get my other one and see if, yeah, you know, way to pay attention, Michelle. So the one I have been buying was the Sugar Crush one. I knew that. I don't know why I picked this one up. Yeah, I don't like this one. Yeah, it's too perfumey smelling. So that's going back. Um, so what I wanted to say is about this. this is the first time I had anybody really compliment me about my uh, perfume. So I had two people, like I gave them a hug and I gave my sister a hug and she goes, ooh, Mimi, you smell good. And then my, um, my niece-in-law said the same thing. And this was after I had been wearing it for a while. So it lasts pretty good, long time. So this, this is my second vial. It's almost gone. So, I guess I'll be taking this back. Yeah, I don't, I don't like it. I definitely... Do you guys use this? I like it. It's very, um, sweet smelling. Okay, and then the last thing I got, which I debated whether to get it or not. I hope I'm not going to regret it, because it was a little more than I paid for a shirt. But, I got this shirt from Target. And it's a little short in the front. You know how it's like lower in the back than it is in the front? But it feels like it's a little bit too low in the front. But I'm going to try it. It has this embroider on the bottom. And it has, it's like sort of Muslim-ish. I don't know what you want to call it. And then this, isn't that pretty? It's so pretty. pretty. And it's the... Knox Rose brand and it was $27.99 yeah I don't usually pay that much for shirts but I don't know I thought I would treat myself um yeah you'll see that in maybe a video and I'll show it to you I'm not going to try it on now all right guys that's it for my target haul uh, I definitely needed some retail therapy <laughs> Oh, uh, just been tired and then of course this little mishap and everything like that. So make sure you watch the little end of the video of the shout out. And I'm going to put a link to, um, well, I'll talk about that in a minute. So thanks guys. Love you so much. I will be doing a video. Um, thank you so much for all my 6,000 subscribers. You guys are awesome. You keep me motivated and, um, I will be doing a Q&A video, so make sure you put your comments down below of what questions you have for me. And um, I think that was all I wanted to say. I'll say more stuff about that whole 6,000 subscriber YouTube um, anniversary thing in the next um, the Q&A video. All right, guys. Watch the shout out. Okay guys, today's shout out goes to Christy by Inspired by Christy. I am loving her channel. I just subscribed to her channel like two weeks ago and I'm loving watching her channel. I saw her videos and channel through the collab that I recently did. It was the um, tray collab that, that was put on by Zane at, at, uh, at Home with Zane. And she did her um, trade decor collab. I don't even remember what the name of it was. 
All right, get it right, Michelle. It was my tray display collab that was put on by Zane um, from At Home with Zane. So she showed, throw, she showed three different ways to do her tray, and it was beautiful. I just like the way she talks. She's very cheerful, and if you like home decor, I don't know if she's going to be doing any other kind of videos, but most of her videos are about home decor, and she re recently won... Um, I guess it was a contest that was put on by Zane at a home with Zane and Sharon from She's So Fabulous. They had to do a QVC, uh, type video as if they were trying to sell something and she won the, the little, um, contest. So I thought that was fabulous. So guys, check her out. Check Christy's channel out. I'll put her name down here. I'll put the link to her channel in the description, but make sure you watch the end of this video because on the end screen I will put her little picture on there and you can click on that and go right to her channel. Alright guys that's it for today's shout out and I'm hopefully I'll be doing this in most of my videos if I can and until then enjoy your day.